This tutorial will teach you how to block your schedule and request, confirm, and deny appointments. Before we begin, we recommend using Google Chrome as your browser. First, we'll teach you how to block your schedule. Click on My Schedule on the top banner, then click My Meetings. You'll now see all the meeting slots for the entire event. You will only need to manage your schedule for the exchanges you are participating in. For example, if you are only participating in the group exchange, you will only need to block unavailable appointment slots on Friday and Saturday. To block off unavailable meeting times, click Make Unavailable under a meeting slot. You can reverse this change easily by clicking Make Available under a blocked time. Next, we'll teach you how to make an appointment. Navigate to the Exchange tab and click the company you'd like to have a meeting with. Pick one of the attending team members at the bottom. Then, click See More Time Slots to show all available meeting times. Slots will only show if you are both free during the available time. As a reminder, the times you see are in your computer's time zone. Click a slot to request an appointment. You can also include a short note with your request. The request will need to be confirmed by the individual you requested to meet with. If someone has requested to meet with you, you'll receive a notification. Click the bell at the top right to view your notifications. Click the check mark to confirm or the X to deny. You'll receive a notification when your meeting has been accepted. Appointments do not auto-approve and will need to be accepted. Next, we'll show you how to view your colleagues' meetings. Navigate to the homepage and click the pencil next to your company name. Then, click on Meetings. Here, you can see everyone your colleagues have requested to meet with. Finally, we'll show you how to start an appointment. When it's time for a meeting, click on the blue button to get started. Give access to both your camera and your microphone. You can click the three dots to share your screen. We recommend keeping your phone or a clock next to you to keep track of time, so you know when to transition to your next appointment. When the meeting is over, press the red Hang Up button. Then, navigate back to your schedule and start your next appointment. If the appointment is started first by the other participant, you'll receive a pop-up notification. Click the button to begin your meeting.